all right beautiful so if we click on this it says it says this are you sure are you sure what so we need to fix that uh so here we're gonna do confirm are you sure you wish to apply for a checkout or payout so the idea is um when this person applies admin looks through the account transfers the necessary money into their bank account that they specified they specify a bank account here admin gets the application transfers the money through whichever means bank transfer wire transfer paypal whatever once they transfer it admin will now click the other button here to say hey we just um paid you out so that's it so um this pop-up shows up and um if we refresh it now says something meaningful so it says are you sure you wish to apply for payout then okay and uh, cancel makes sense and then the next thing we want to do is that if we click ok once this pop-up shows up and you click ok what will happen is that it will try to submit the content of this form to this uh this request this um route you understand and the route we should deal with is account and we have to create the route it doesn't exist yet and i'll just call it apply for payout now that we've not um, created this um route if we try and refresh now we'll see an error telling us that this route doesn't exist so what you see apply for payout not defined you see then another thing is that the method is using to submit the the payout application is delete no we don't need delete we just need post request simple so i think we should do that too with the second form post request simple post request apply for payouts easy peasy so um this one should say are you sure you wish to confirm payout all right uh, oh, yeah i think that makes sense so this is post request to beautiful now we have to go to a uh, platform i think the the route for this one is um this account and the route should be uh, mark as paid as paid or confirm payout anyone you want to use for yours so i'm gonna this we need to create these two routes so i'll copy it now uh we need to go to create a route we have to go to our routes file or folder at it's under resources routes web and um, only for logged in users so inside this group we're going to create the route so i'll type start typing route it's a post request remember and then it's going to where uh, account slash pay who remembers i forgotten so i'm going to paste yeah slash apply for payout beautiful and then uh, where will it go to it will head to um comma uh accounts controller so accounts controller which function we're going to we're going to um smartly name the function the same thing so that it's consistent then we're going to give it a name now if you do this even though you've created the route you've not given it a route name if you refresh it will still give you the same error because we've not created the route name so we give the route name name and then paste close so that's what we have now name accounts dot um, apply for payout now if we refresh the error will change the error will no longer be for apply for payout it will be for markers paid um really okay yeah the reason why it's not throwing error for mark as paid is because mark as paid is inside an if statement i'm trying to find where it is I think um, it's in show. Show the blade. Beautiful. So this one is inside an if statement. It didn't show. So that's why it's not throwing an error. But nevertheless, we still need to create the route. So I'll come to web. I'm closing this. Come to web. Let's close this too. Close this. I have too many um, paid files open. Alright. So we get to web.php. I'll paste this on top. Then duplicate this line by Ctrl C, Ctrl V, duplicate it. Then copy this line. And um, I think I just need to copy marker speed, delete this, and uh, replace marker speed, marker speed, marker 
that's pretty beautiful, beautiful. All right, so Marcus Pay works uh, for us now. Now we need to go and create this function and actually make it work in the next video.